What is going on, guys? Welcome back to the Swell Eats channel. Yes. Um, 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 um. Yeah, we are going to good old Burger King again. Yes, I know you guys are asking for the Burger King, so we're giving it to you guys again. And I think I'm going to try the Impossible Whopper. I haven't had it. You had it before, Dave? Uh, nope. Yeah, so this is brand new. We're going to try it today. Well, that's what they say it looks like. We're about to find out. What is going on, Swill Eats family? All right, so we're back at Burger King here, and today we're going to do the Impalco Whopper like we promised, guys. So we have the Impalco Whopper itself, which is, uh, what, $5.99? I didn't know it was that expensive. I thought maybe like 3 or $4 maybe, nah. if that. But it's $5.99 by itself. And then I have the original Whopper itself right here. So let's go ahead and open these bad boys up real quick. Now, if you guys don't know that the Impalco Whopper is not actual meat, it's like a plant-based thing. So if you guys are vegetarians, I can't say vegans because you got the bread. You can't really say too much with that. But yeah, got that pop. Man, it looks like a regular burger, man. Yeah. I mean, you can tell if you look at it. So I'll get you real close here. You can see the lettuce, real nice. Um, really nice display of everything, the meat. You can see how it looks. Well, it's not meat, sorry, but it, what would be meat, but it's plant-based. You can just see the texture of it. So it's much darker than um, the regular Whopper, Shonen Whopper. And now that we got the Impossible, like the regular Whopper, it comes with everything on it, man. It's talking to you guys. It's got the little lettuce. It's got the tomato. It's got the pickles and everything like that. It's jam packed full of everything. Jam packed. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and half this up because I don't. I don't think Dave want to get the regular Whopper because he's on a diet. So I'm gonna try it. He's on a diet. <laughs> so we're gonna half this other Whopper up. But first of all, as a matter of fact, let's go ahead and cut it right now, Dave. Go ahead, right. You can break off piece. Break it off. One, two, three. Break that off. Oh snap! Right down the middle. And this is for comparison reasons. That's all we're trying to do. Yeah, so we're gonna compare it to what it tastes like. So I'm gonna go ahead and get a bite of this regular Whopper first, just to reminisce of what it tastes taste is like. Yeah, so I'm gonna take um, my pickles off and thing. stuff. Just get a little small bite there. Mm-hmm. 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 Amazing. Now. I don't think I get tired of eating these. I've only been eating a Whopper maybe like two years. I've been sleeping on Whoppers all these years, man. But since I've been getting them, oh my God, dude. Amazing. They're not bad at all. All right, so. All right. Yeah, the this. texture and everything like that is good. It's consistent. You can't go wrong with that, man. I'm going to eat this good old Impossible Whopper now. I'm going to pull all this stuff out. I don't like all this stuff on mine. I'm taking it the same way. Take it as you get it? Yep. As it comes, the best right. way. Here we go, man. One, two, three. Mmm. Mmm. What the heck? That's a little different. Wow. When people tell me it tastes the exact same, it doesn't taste the exact same. Quite the difference. But it's, it's really close to me. Like, it is. You wouldn't know. Hold on. I can't believe it. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Scale of one to five. It's a five. It's good. I'm gonna give it a four piece. Yeah. I'm gonna get four. This is really good. Mm-hmm. Good. Mm. That's -hmm. really good. The way they made it, the way it tastes, the way it feels. There's not no difference. No napkins, of course. Yeah, this is not bad. Shoo. Now, it's not as messy as the regular Whopper, but it gets the job done. I'm sold. Holy crap. I was at work and somebody asked me, have you tried the Impossible Whopper? Because we have another one at work. It's called the Beyond Burger. And that thing is amazing, man. Oh, my God. But it's good. But yeah, I never tried this, but now, yeah. Yeah, this is like the future now of burgers. Mm -hmm. So now, like I said, everybody could eat it plant-based, you know what I'm saying? You have options out there, especially if you're on a diet and you want something much more healthier, you can say, hey, I'm going to eat a burger. Mm -hmm. I mean, you're going to pay a little bit more, but, I mean, it's really good. It's not half-assed. It's really good. Yeah, pay the cost to be the boss. But damn. I eat both of them, man. It's like, what? This is really good. I can't believe it. I mean, 
Cigar flavor is not dry. I thought it would be really dry. You know, like, ah. and you can taste it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this it. is not bad. I thought it would be dry too. It's not dry at all. No, uh, this texture is great. Mm hmm. But definitely in the comments below, guys, put your experience with the Impossible Whopper. Have you had one? Are you willing to try one? Yeah. This is a damn good burger, man. Yeah, if you haven't tried it, you should try it. It's really good. Mmm. Mm. Dude. <laughs> I'm surprised. I didn't Dude. think it would be this good. <laughs> mm -hmm. Now I know this because I'm really hungry. Mmm. It's really good. I'm not really hungry, but this is good. Mmm-hmm. Mm. I mean, I'm hungry, but I ain't that hungry. This is this is good. This is. Not actually getting full off of it. I mean, it has a little bit more bread. I mean, they make these things big. They use big bread. It's big. It's not as thick as a regular Whopper. Regular Whopper, I think it's a little bit thick, maybe. It's about the same, I guess. Mm-hmm. Shoot. I'm gonna get for now on. <laughs> mm. Alright guys, but that for, for sure. Put in the comments where you want to see next time. Now keep some keep in keep in mind some play some things, some restaurants are geographically um, specific. We may not have everything here in South Florida. We have a lot of restaurants in our area. But let me know. One restaurant I wish we did have was a water burger. That place is amazing. You ever had water burger before? Never. Dude. Best burgers, best apple pies, best everything. I wish we had one. Mm-hmm. Man, I can't stop taking a bite. No, I'm not gonna stop until it's done. This is good. Mm-hmm. They can keep the pickles and onions and tomatoes and all that crap. I don't eat that stuff. Mm-hmm. No, that's real good. All right, guys. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next time. Like and subscribe. Make sure you hit the bell notification, guys. And we'll always keep you guys up to date on the latest trends. Check out our Facebook and our Twitter. The links are in the description below. Thanks for listening. Peace.